My name is Brenda Willett and I am the Executive Director of Care Builders at Home here in Omaha, Nebraska. August 26th is Women's Equality Day and instead of us doing a Caregiver Tip Tuesday, I wanted to talk about what it's like to be a woman and a business owner for a business here in Omaha, Nebraska. I have been in healthcare for 25 years and it's not always been an easy part of my life or it's not always been easy for me to advance in the realm that I was in in healthcare and I believe it's because I'm a woman. Healthcare is a very dominated field and to be a business professional um, you have to not only know your craft but you also have to have personality, you also have to have people skills, you have to network, you have to um, be relatable, and you have to fit in. And for somebody like me, fitting in is not my priority. I am three months away from my PhD and I think that that degree says a lot and was not necessary for me to get where I am today as a business owner but was mandatory in order for me to be respected in a very dominated profession. As a woman, I take pride in the fact that I stand out. I take pride in the fact that I have come overcome every obstacle that I have been faced with, and I now can proudly say that I am a business owner in a company and doing what I was meant to do. I've spent 25 years in healthcare and I started as a certified nursing assistant, ended up in hospital administration, and now am the proud owner of Care Builders at Home here in my community. And I would like for my testimonial to be something for anybody who decides that they have a dream, they have a desire, and they have the determination to know that the impossible is always possible and to be able to stand out and stand proud and be honored for and acknowledged for the accomplishments, but always doing the right thing, making the right choices, making purposeful and intentional choices and making impactful choices for people who cross your path. My employees who work for me they are my priority because I also want them to succeed. We are a predominantly female-run business. Most of my caregivers are females. All of my office staff are females, and I'm proud of that. And I believe that makes us stronger. We are more unified. We have more commonality. And we are proud to be doing what we're doing and be standing where we are and how we've grown, how we've made a difference, how we don't get acknowledged for. There are women that have invented things, invented surgeries, procedures, um, you know, made discoveries that don't get acknowledged for that. We as women are being acknowledged more and more every day for our efforts and our work in whatever career that we're in. And it's an honor and a privilege for me to be a woman and to be in this day and age and being able to be recognized and noticed for who we've always been. We are very strong, we are very dominant, we are determined, and everything that we do as females comes from a space of compassion and it's purposeful. As a female, it's important for me to support other female business owners and I pride myself in having amazing partnerships in our community with what I do now as a home care owner, but also as I've evolved in my career over 25 years and worked with physicians, female physicians, nurse practitioners, nurses, um, physical therapists, a lot of different people in different positions in healthcare. Um, my female partnerships, we grow in strength and our time will come. As the business owner of Care Builders at Home, as a person who has spent 25 years growing in my craft, getting my education and my degrees, what got me here was my faith, my determination, my dreams, and my desires to succeed. So, happy Women's Equality Day. 
and we'll see you next Tuesday for the caregiver tip of the week. You can visit us on all of our social media platforms. You can find us on LinkedIn, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. Our website is www.carebuildersathomeomaha.com. All of our other social media platforms are CBAH Omaha.